here I have for you another example based on definite integrals. Example 5. Okay, let's see how this is done. Now, you are asked to integrate this. 1 over 3 minus 2x to the power of 5. So what do you do first? Bring the power 5 up. Bring the full bracket up. So the power becomes negative 5. And look carefully, this is a linear expression. So when we integrate this, negative 2 comes here. Negative 5 plus 1 is negative 4. And you bring the negative 4 down. Okay? So negative times negative is positive. 2 times 4 is 8. We bring this bracket down. Power negative 4 becomes power 4. Okay. Now we substitute. Okay. First we substitute 3 here. Okay. 8. Bracket. 3 minus 2 times 3. You substitute x with 3. And then you substitute 1. Here. Okay. Now, so you have 1 over 8 times 3 minus 2 times 3 power 4 minus 1 over 8 times 3 minus 2 power 4. Right. So from here you get 3 minus 6, negative 3. So this becomes negative 3 to the power 4. 3 minus 2 is 1. This becomes 1 to the power 4. Okay? Get it? Okay, now you see the common factor 1 over 8. This is the common factor. One of you bring it out. So what have we got left? 1 over negative 3 power 4 minus 1 over 1 power 4. Negative 3 power 4 is 81. So 1 over 81. 1 to the power of anything anyway is 1. So 1 over 1 is 1. Right. Now, 1 over 81 minus 1. What is 1? 81 over 81. So 1 over 81 minus 81 over 81. You get negative 80 over 81. Now, we cancel. 1 times 8. Negative 10 times 8. So, this is your answer. Negative 10 over 81. As simple as that. Thank you. Hi. Welcome to another example of definite integrals. So here I have for you example 6. Where you are asked to evaluate 5 over 1 plus 2x power 4 you integrate with respect to x within these limits 3 and 0 ok let's see how this is done first you bring this up as usual ok power 4 when you bring up becomes power negative 4 ok and you integrate now. So when you integrate, negative 4 plus 1 is negative 3. And then you bring the negative 3 down. Okay? This negative 3 comes down here. You divide by negative 3. And this 1 plus 2x is a linear expression. Therefore, you bring the 2 down here. Okay? So, 2 times negative 3 is negative 6. You bring this bracket down. Power negative 3, you bring it down. Power 3. Okay? Within these limits, 3 and 0. So, first, we substitute x with 3. 
here. Minus, we substitute x with 0. Yeah. 2 times 3, 6. 6 plus 1, 7. So 6 times 7 cube. Okay, minus negative 5 over 6 times 2 times 0 is 0. 1 plus 0 is 1. 6 times 1, 6. Okay. Now, from this step onwards, you look at the common factor. This is the common factor. The common factor is negative 5 over 6. Take out negative 5 over 6. So what have we got here? 1 over 7 cube. 7 cube is 3, 4, 3. Minus 1. Because this has been taken out. Okay? 1. And what is 1? 3, 4, 3 over 3, 4, 3. Basing on this. 1 minus 3, 4, 3 is negative 3, 4, 2 over 3, 4, 3. Okay? Now we cancel. This is 1 time. This is 57 times. 5 times 57, 285. Over 3, 4, 3. This is your answer. As simple as that. Get it? It's very, very simple if you apply the right rules. Okay? Thank you.